Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tupo. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Please subscribe, like, comment, give me a thumbs up, guys. Today, I'm going to show you an easy way you can achieve small box braids. So if you guys want to see how I achieve this look, please continue watching. All right, guys, my hair is already washed and moisturized. I already sectioned my hair into 60 pieces. So I just wanted to do this so it's quick, guys. Otherwise, it's going to take us forever, okay? So I'm going to be using this expression hair. This is 96 inches, guys, and I'm using four packs. So what I'm doing is I'm just taking it out of the pack, and then I'm just going to cut a little bit at the end right there because I wanted my braids to be nice and long, sis. I'm going on vacation. I'm going to start stretching the hair just the way I'm doing, you know, just pulling the ends so that my hair has nice tail stretch ends to it, okay? So what I'm doing is after I pre-stretch my hair, I'm just going to start sectioning it. I'm going to apply Shine and Jam just to make sure my scalp is really nice and sleek or whatever, okay? And then I'm going to section the hair into two. I'll place the hair, the braiding hair in the middle, take a rubber band and secure it, sis. gonna take a little bit more of the shine and jam okay and then I'm going to apply that to my natural hair so that it's nice and sleek so that it actually blends very well with the braiding hair when I tie the rubber band I'm just gonna section the hair a little bit from both sides of the hair so I have two sections right there right a little bit from this side and then a little bit from the other side that way I have three equal sides guys And then I'm just gonna take the natural hair and combine it with the middle piece, the hair that I just sectioned from both sides. And then I'm just gonna start braiding all the way down. So once you start braiding down, sis, just make sure you're holding your hair on the scalp like a little bit tighter, okay? That way it's really nice and snug or whatever. And that's about it. If you're getting like breakage with um, rubber bands, make sure you try the shine and jam technique that way it's nice and silky and actually when you're taking them out make sure you moisturize your scalp sis first okay so this is the same technique that i did with the jumbo um, box braids people were asking me if this works with tiny braids okay so i wanted to show you guys because i was like yes I'm, I'm going on vacation i'm going to be using the same style why not show my sisters how i achieved this look okay and this is so easy guys because anybody can actually wear this type of hair so if you don't know how to do feed in you want to do like a kind of not less braid situation you can do this style sis because let me tell you something they've been looking real cute people don't even know that this is a rubber band method sis okay very very easy beginner friendly you do not even have to know how to braid to do this sis i mean you can just try doing this and it's going to come all the way through trust me just try it keep practicing the only the only problem with the braids that i did this time says oh my gosh it took me forever because they are long they'll go all the way to my thighs guys i was like why did i even do this to myself but i was like you know what i'm going on vacation so listen i will do this and it's gonna take me forever but you know what it is what it is this is the longest hair has taken me i was still talking sis have you subscribed to my channel? Don't forget to turn on your notification button so you do not miss out on any uploads because this channel is getting what? Juicy! Yes! Sis. Anyway, guys, I'm going to show you guys again in the front. So that's exactly what I'm doing. Say, taking some shine and jam, applying it to my hair sectioning the hair into two taking the braiding hair placing it in the middle take the rubber band secure the hair making sure you're not securing it way too tight that you're gonna have a headache or whatever or that you're gonna break your hair sis so just secure it enough that it's really nice and snug you know it looks like it actually feels like your hair is you know your hair is nice and secure on the bottom okay anyway so once you're done you're just gonna take a little bit of more of the shine and jam and apply it to your hair that way it's really nice and slick that way it blends very well when you are braiding it down so now you're just gonna section a little bit of hair from both sides okay once you're done you're just gonna um take the hair your natural hair combine it with the braiding hair in the middle right there and then start braiding all the way down 
you can actually do this. I have a lot of people who are new braiders, like who do not even know how to braid, who have been able to do this technique right here and actually it works every time sis you just need to have patience if you're going to do this tiny ones i actually spent four hours sis doing this okay i am super duper excited because we are going on vacation and it's my sister's 40th birthday yes my sister is gonna be turning 40 Not a lot of people can do feeding braids, sis. But a lot of people want to do braids on themselves, okay? They want to do braids, long braids, tiny braids. But they're like, how do I even start? Like, where do I even begin, sis? Watch this video. Make sure you share this with your cousin, your bestie, your aunt, and your mama. That way, everybody is doing these braids by themselves, sis, okay? When I tell you these are nice and long, you can make them shoulder length. You can make them waist length. Today's shout out goes to Maureen Kavina. Hi sis, thank you so much for supporting me. I love you, you are a real MVP today sis. Thank you for rocking with me. Thank you for all the love. I really appreciate the love that you've been giving my channel sis. This is the longest I've ever done braids, sis. But I've been seeing people on Instagram have these long braids and I was like, you know what, let me try them. And I just wanted to do this easy technique. That way I don't have to spend the whole day. Somebody was just telling me they spent 12 hours braiding their hair. I was like, what? You can actually rock braids by yourself using this method. And it actually looks like, you know, not less braids. I'm going to apply shine and jam just to make sure my scalp is really nice and sleek or whatever okay and then i'm going to section the hair into two i'll place the hair the braiding hair in the middle take a rubber band and secure it when i tie the rubber band i'm just gonna section the hair a little bit from both sides and then i'm just gonna start braiding all the way down apply some mousse and make sure my hair is laid all the way down sis and then I'm just gonna take some hot water I just want to you know seal the ends or whatever so I'm just using the hot water just be careful sis and that's about it use a towel dry it up I'm using my coconut oil and Jamaican black castor oil to moisturize my scalp you already know what it is that's my favorite combination when it comes to moisturizing my scalp So once I'm done, I'm just gonna use my booster, my edge booster to lay this baby hairs down, sis. And baby, when I tell you, this style came all the way through. Yes, braid. I am loving these tiny box braids using rubber bands. Honey, when I tell you, this is the easiest way that you can get your box braids, okay? can do this small medium large this method actually works on any any length i am loving this braids let me know if you guys are feeling this braids let me know if you guys are loving it i am vacation ready honey i am ready to go you know me i cannot be the accessorizing queen without adding some accessories so you know i gotta add a little bit of gold is here and there okay so that's what i did i added some gold accessories and bad bad it took the braids all the way to boom, 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 100. thank you guys so so much for watching my videos please subscribe to your girl let's get to 300k because bad bad at this point we are moving it is up from here thank you for taking your time watching my videos thank you for sharing oh my gosh you guys are making a girl's dream come all the way through. yes and make sure you share this with your cousin your bestie your mama and your aunt because sharing is caring and i will catch you guys in my next one bye